episode, y'all. So, this is Blue Star 3. And Nikki Blue on TikTok. I've decided just to be real with y'all this year. And if I'm real with y'all, it's going to be 99% negative, and if I'm lucky, 1% positive. This is how my life is right now. Um, I was in the hospital roughly three days. And... <laughs> When I got back home from the hospital, from the first two surgeries, um, some of my Christmas gifts were mistakenly thrown away. I got some gift cards for Christmas because I was so sick, because I was having my gallbladder problem. I didn't activate them. And they got thrown away. So half my Christmas gifts are all gone now. Because my mom thought they were trash. Um, she helped me a little bit the first day. But her logic is just horrible. Um, the doctor said not to lift gallons of milk and do this and that. Well, if I want drink or whatever, I have to do it. So, I do feel it pull my belly when I do it. But if I don't do it, then I just don't get the drink. She's like, well, when I was pregnant and when I get out of the hospital, we can do whatever we want because we're women. And, you know, pregnant women shouldn't have limitations. And I'm just like, I don't argue with my mom, but I'm just like, I, I wasn't in the hospital for being pregnant. And if it was her way, I'd be dead. And I'm serious. I needed to go to the hospital on Christmas Eve. But she told me no. She's like, nope, you're not calling 911. You're not going to the hospital. I'm like, mom, I've never been in this much pain. Nope, 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 you're not going. So I didn't go. So it got worse. And then a couple of days later, I just couldn't take it anymore. She wouldn't take me to the hospital. I had to have a friend take me to the hospital. Because she had to have her coffee and morning news. And, you know, um, had these surgeries. I've had two so far. I still have one left. Am I grateful for her? Of course, you know, we're family. But, you know... It's poor people problems, you know. I'm going to stop talking about rich people problems because I don't have those. But, you know, it's just... People should not put off going to see a doctor because they're poor. You know, especially when it's life or death or could be. Unless you want to die and then go ahead, put it off, you know. But it's just been hard. Like I said, half my Christmas presents are gone. Um, my stomach hurts from lifting things. So I might have a hernia now. I don't know. Um, I just don't really have any support or anything. Um, I just wish I could have stayed in the hospital a couple more days for the recovery portion, but I guess it's like that for everyone unless you do have good money and medical, but I do find it quite crazy how they just send people home right away after major surgery. I don't know, I guess they did that in other countries too, but I just think it's um, surprising that um, they just send you home and they can't even take care of yourself. 
I, I bet a lot of people die when they get home from the hospital because they don't have the help. Anyway, um, the only, they only gave me like three days of painkillers. They're already gone. Um, they weren't the good stuff, so don't get excited. I'm having a major headache right now. And I had one last night. I had a headache that was so bad that I could feel the heartbeat in my brain. And when I touched my head, it hurts. It's kind of coming back again. And of course, if I go to the hospital again, it's going to piss my mom off. Because, you know, she's an expert with headaches. She's like, well, I have migraines. It's just a migraine. You don't need to go to the doctor. What do I do, y'all? If I listen to her again, I might die. Because her medical advice is stay home and do nothing. And if I would have kept doing that, I would be dead. So, I don't know what to do, but the headache's getting worse again. And I've never had headaches, so for her to say, oh, it's just a migraine, get used to them. No, this isn't a normal headache, y'all. It's like... It's like my head swells and I can, every time my heart beats, I can feel my heart beat in my brain and it hurts. So it's just weird. Not a normal headache. I've never had one like this before. And it hurts. So, but, um, I have to get the stent out in a couple months. And my mental health ain't too well either, but I'm in so much pain that honestly I haven't had a chance to mentally catch up with myself, but I am bumming out, you know, I have the kind of family where I'll never be able to eat really greasy or really yummy foods again ever, and I know that, right, and then I come home and um, my mom makes dinner and she has this like Stouffer's lasagna and I get nothing except for like chicken. And um, I'm not going to bitch too much because I am grateful to be alive. But I just thought that there would have been just a little more sens sensitivity in this issue. You know, if I had a daughter, actually, I can't say that because I haven't had one, so I'm not even going to go there. But, you know, I don't know if I, like, when I hang out with my vegetarian friends, I don't eat meat, <laughs> you know? And so, I would have thought someone that's hanging on someone that can never have something that yummy again wouldn't just blatantly eat it in front of them. I hate bitching. But it's been my life, so, and I'm sick of coming on TikTok and YouTube with a fake-ass smile, acting like my life is oh so great, because it's not. I have a shitty-ass life, and um, that's what I'm going to talk about now. You know, screw Disney, screw being happy, tell y'all how it is, and that's my life right now. That is my life. It is just shitty, and um, nobody cares. But there's a new celebrity in town, and dude, she deserves it. Gypsy Rose Blanchard. Follow her, man. Let's make her more famous than Britney Spears, y'all. <laughs> I want to see this famous felon live the life of her dreams that I know I'll never have. I want to see her... With Taylor Swift on stage singing. <laughs> anyway, I love you guys. And let's make Gypsy the world's most famous felon. And I love you guys. And I have so many updates, but this will be the only one for now. Like I said, I have a headache and I have no more pain medicine. So I just have to deal with it. I love you guys. This is Nikki Blue on TikTok and Blue Star 3 on YouTube.
Love you guys.